Hey guys, did you know that China has earned the nickname Infrastructure Maniac? This nickname isn't derogatory, rather it reflects the astonishment of foreigners at the speed of China's development. In today's video, we'll showcase China's impressive construction technology whose engineering has left America's engineers in awe. But before we dive in, we kindly ask for your support by liking this video and subscribing to us. We value your thoughts and invite you to share your opinions on these remarkable construction technologies in the comments below. Without further ado, let's embark on this extraordinary journey. You know, just in case you get bored of being above water and want to explore what's underneath, it's like having a convertible, except instead of putting the top down, you're diving into the ocean. You're diving into the ocean. You're diving into the ocean. The interior. Oh boy, where do I even start? Remember those fancy hotel suites you see in movies? Triple that luxury, and you're getting close. We're talking about 4,500 square meters of interior space, designed by Raymond Alton Design. Basically the Michelangelo of yacht interiors. Here's a mind-blowing detail. There's a spiral staircase that goes through all seven decks. But this isn't your regular staircase. It's a piece of art that looks like it's floating in midair. The steps are made of... Now let's talk bedrooms, or should I say floating palaces. The master suite is bigger than most people's entire homes. But here's the kicker. It has a private deck. Not just any deck. A deck with its own jacuzzi, outdoor lounge, and privacy screens that rise from the floor at the touch of a button. James Bond, eat your heart out. Privacy screens that rise from the foot weight, there's more. The yacht has multiple pools. Because why have one when you can have several? The main pool can be converted into a dance floor. Yeah, now let me tell you about something that blew my mind. The spa complex. This isn't your regular gym with a sauna. We're talking about a full-blown wellness center that would make five-star resorts jealous. There's a hammam. That's a Turkish bath, for those wondering. The drill and blast method, also known as the mining method, involves using explosives to carve out a section, removing the rubble, and lining the tunnel walls. This cycle repeats until the tunnel is complete. Since blasting can disrupt surrounding rock layers, this method is often used in stable geological conditions. When fractures and rock formations cause water seepage, engineers inject grout to create a watertight barrier for stability. China's first underwater tunnel, the Xiamen the Sanan Tunnel was built using this method. The TBM and shield tunneling methods involve large drilling machines. TBMs are used in hard rock environments, while shield machines excel in soft soil layers and feature waterproof capabilities. These machines simultaneously excavate and assemble concrete segments to support surrounding rock, preventing tunnel collapses. The shield tunneling method is particularly versatile due to its full mechanization. Lastly, the Immerse Tube method involves submerging prefabricated tunnel segments and connecting them underwater. Waterproofing the connections is critical. The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridges Tunnel was built using this method. Constructing an immersed tunnel is a complex and precise process, akin to crafting a masterpiece. The first step is building a dry dock, similar to a shipyard. Engineers excavate a massive rectangular water tank near the tunnel site and use techniques like slope excavation and diaphragm walls to ensure a level base and watertight conditions. This creates a solid foundation for fabricating the tunnel segments within the dry dock. Steel reinforcement cages form the skeleton of the tunnel segments, and concrete is poured into molds to create the segment walls. After curing, engineers maintain optimal concrete quality using ultrasonic mist cooling internally and geotextile blankets externally for moisture retention. Outfitting the tunnel segments is a critical phase, including installing ballast water systems, pipelines, and monitoring systems. The segment's exterior surfaces are coated with polyurethane to ensure waterproofing. The ends of the segments, crucial for connection, are equipped with steel bulkheads, waterproof gaskets, and sealed doors to maintain integrity during during installation. Once outfitting is complete, the dry dock is flooded, and the segments undergo rigorous testing to ensure their readiness for transport and installation. The foundation trench for the immersed tunnel must be meticulously excavated. Large dredgers handle rough excavation, while smaller dredgers perform precision digging and leveling. Vessels finalize the riverbed's flatness, ensuring the error does not exceed 4 centimeters to enable precise placement of the segments. 
Next comes the most exciting phase, segment transport and installation. Tugboats and anchor cables position the segments at the designated location, guided by GPS navigation and digital monitoring systems for millimeter level accuracy. During installation, engineers flood the segments to gently lower them into the trench and align them for connection. This phase demands exceptional technical expertise and teamwork. After installation, the segments are reinforced with gravel backfill, geotextiles, and anti-scour stone cages to ensure structural safety and long-term stability. Finally, the interior of the tunnel is equipped with electrical systems, fire prevention setups, and decorative finishes. High-quality roadways are laid to ensure the tunnel meets transportation and safety standards. From dry dock construction to segment alignment, every step in the creation of the immersed tunnel exemplifies engineering precision. The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridges tunnel not only overcame nature's barriers, but also showcased Chinese engineers' ability to push the boundaries of innovation. Now, let's travel to... That sink in speaking of entertainment. Forget everything you know about home theaters. The Serene has an IMAX cinema, but that's just the beginning. There's a piano lounge, multiple bars, and, get this, a climbing wall. Because apparently, now let's get a bit technical, because the engineering behind this beast is absolutely insane. The Serene was built by Fincantieri, an Italian shipyard that's been building ships since 1780. Think about that. They've been building ships longer than the United States. Remember that Saudi prince I mentioned earlier? Here's where the story gets wild. In 2015, Prince Mohammed bin Salman spotted the Serene while vacationing in the south of France. He liked it. But here's something most people don't know about the Serene. It's actually environmentally conscious. I know, I know. Sounds weird for a super yacht, right? But it has advanced waste management systems, water treatment facilities, and uses special paint that reduces drag in the water. Want to know what it takes to keep this floating marvel running? A crew of 52 people. That reduces drag in the water keep this floating marvel running a crew of keep this the team used innovative techniques including cable stayed bridge technology and precision alignment of massive steel trusses in mid-air despite strong canyon winds they also found ways to overcome challenges like impassable rivers by disassembling beams and transporting them in parts speeding up construction China used advanced steel for the cables lifting the bridge deck, ensuring stability against strong winds and water vapor erosion. The bridge deck is supported by steel cables spanning 250 feet, equivalent to the distance between New York City and Washington, D.C. It carries 22,000 tons of weight, marking it as one of the most colossal bridge structures in the world. This bridge not only supported local poverty alleviation efforts, but also silenced foreign critics. Finished in 2016, it cut travel time between Yunnan and Guo to just one hour, representing a monumental achievement in China's bridge-building history. The Bayan River Bridge is part of China's broader infrastructure triumph, including the Heyo Bay Bridge, which links Ningbo and Shanghai, and the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, which reduced travel time and boosted the regional economy. China's bridge-building expertise is rooted in its technological advancements, such as world-class steel and self-reliant manufacturing. The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge used over 420,000 tons of steel, showing China's dominance in the industry. Other impressive feats include bridges across China's diverse terrain, from plateaus to seas, reshaping transportation networks and boosting economies. China's ongoing projects include deep sea bridges and integrating AI and IoT for smarter infrastructure. These future projects promise global connectivity, possibly even enabling transcontinental bridges. Each new bridge is a symbol of China's ambition, ingenuity, and determination. China's bridge-building achievements are transforming global infrastructure, with over 20,000 new bridges constructed annually. These accomplishments highlight China's leadership in innovation, technological advancement, and regional economic development. With six of the world's 10 longest-span suspension bridges, China's presence in the global bridge-building industry is undeniable. 
the milestone of a kilometer scale dual use suspension bridge for both rail and road traffic marks China's pioneering use of suspension bridge designs and high speed railway construction. Its completion solidifies the nation's leading position in large span bridge building technology. The Wulong Mountain Yangtze River Bridge, as the world's first high speed railway suspension bridge, sets an example for future projects. The Chinese standards it established are undeniably of global significance. This bridge has ushered China's high speed rail into the suspension bridge era, and more importantly, it ensures that the name China is the first to appear in the records of high speed railway suspension bridges worldwide. While the world remains the same, China is no longer the same. With its infrastructure powerhouse, China is taking on the heavy responsibility of historical missions. It will continue to innovate and drive its giant ship steadily toward a promising future. China is a nation of resilience and determination. Its hardworking people embody the essence of perseverance and dedication. Despite facing numerous challenges and enduring profound pain, they never cease to strive for greatness. China's indomitable spirit is a testament to its unwavering commitment to excellence in times of adversity. China's deep understanding of humanity shines brightly. Its profound philosophical insights encapsulate the essence of compassion, empathy, and unity. China's philosophy of life is a boundless source of wisdom, guiding individuals toward a deeper understanding of the human experience. With its rich history and cultural heritage, China has left an indelible mark on the world. Before I wrap this up, here's something to think about. The Serene isn't just a yacht. It's a testament to what's possible when engineering meets an unlimited budget. It's a floating piece of art that pushes the boundaries of what we think is possible on water. It pushes the boundaries of what If you enjoyed this deep dive into one of the world's most incredible yachts, hit that like button and subscribe for more videos about extraordinary engineering and luxury. Drop a comment below telling me what aspect of the Serene shocked you the most. Was it the submarine, the snow room, or maybe that insane wine cellar? And hey, if you want to see more content like this, the journey through China's mega projects is one of awe and inspiration, a testament to human ingenuity, innovation, and the relentless pursuit of progress. Each of China's major projects showcases the remarkable feats that can be achieved when vision, technology, and sheer determination come together. If you found this video insightful, give it a thumbs up and share it with others. We'd love to hear your thoughts and insights in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel to stay updated with more fascinating content. Thank you for watching and we look forward to seeing you in the next video. Let's continue to explore, learn, and inspire together. Take care and goodbye.